Welcome to the American Association with Brown on this Sunday night. Another great week in the books. Let's start the highlights from Sunday in Kansas City. Salt Dogs and Monarchs wrapping up their set. Salt Dogs went up early on an Alex Baeza home run. The Monarchs were held scoreless until this in the seventh. Herbert Iser comes through with the hit. They needed to tie the game at one. We go to the bottom of the ninth. Two down. A ground ball that would send it to extras, but the throw gets away. And that is how the Monarchs walk it off. They win it two to one to Sioux Falls. Milkman and Canaries. A couple big home runs here for Milwaukee. This one from Kyle Huxdorf, his first career professional home run. Congratulations to him. And then Jose Sermo, not his first home run by any means. A complete game shutout from Shane Rodriguez as well. Milkman win four to nothing to Lake Country, where they had a lot more runs scored. Gold eyes and dot counts. This from Robbie Enriquez tied the game at four, and they weren't done in the second inning. Dayson Cruz here with the RBI triple, an eight-run second inning for Winnipeg, matching the four-run first for Lake Country. Dockhounds came back and tied it, but Winnipeg answered right back. Ramon Bramasco with the two-run shot. Gold Eyes win 14 to 12. Two Cleburne Dogs and Railroaders here in the first. Brian O'Grady gets them on the board. Home run number 20 on the season going to the opposite field. They weren't done in the first. Corey Holland joins in the fun. A three-run shot. Huge opening frame for the Railroaders. And they weren't done. Chicago made it a game later on. Blake Grant Parks, though, in the fourth brings a couple more home on this double and the railroaders able to withstand a comeback from chicago they hang on to win 10 to 9 to sioux city low scoring battle here but juan fernandez in the eighth ties it up with a big fly aka batman for the red hawks and then this is how it was untied ismael alcantara his speed forces the air he comes home to score red hawks win two to one other game tonight was in Gary Cougars won by an 11 to five final. Great start from Greg Molly Galley Cribs Jr. with a couple of homers, including a grand slam. Here's your standings update. Cleburne up two games over Kane County in the East. Chicago slipping down in third and in the West. We have a dead tie. Sioux Falls and Winnipeg at the top. Fargo Moorhead two games back. Nothing on the docket tomorrow. It's a league-wide off day, but we'll be back in full force with six new series on Tuesday night. I'm Matt Yazel. Thanks for watching The Whip Run. We'll be back with you on Tuesday.